Hi, my name is Valia, and today I'd like to share with you a very special book that I wrote, and it's my first children's book. It's called Will You Love Me Still? And it's featuring my favorite cat right here. This is Masia, and she's the inspiration for this book because she gets into all kinds of trouble. As you can see in the illustrations, these are only some of the things my cat does on a daily basis. And this kitty gets into trouble and he always asks, will you still love me? Even though I make a costume out of your favorite curtains, will you keep loving me even when I track dirt all over the house? And it goes on and on and the kitty keeps asking these different questions. And at the very end, the little girl answers, Oh kitty, I will always, always love you, no matter what you ever do. I think this message is very valuable for children to start understanding unconditional love. I'm very much delighted with the way this book has turned out. It is very functional, very child-friendly, and most of all, I'm very impressed with the effect that it has on young readers because so many times I've heard parents say, oh, I read this book with my child, and my little one said, you know, will you love me still, even if I don't go to bed on time? And it leads to so many wonderful discussions and conversations about very important subjects. And the second book I wanna share with you today is brand new, hot off the press, and it's by my mother, and it's called I Love Greens. Now this is a book to introduce toddlers to eating healthy in a story that they will understand and will teach them to start loving greens more. Here we start with a bunch of different animals saying they all love greens. All animals eat greens because green leaves are healthy for everyone. Horses love to eat greens. Cows love greens too. Sheep and pigs enjoy munching green plants everywhere. Elephants and zebras eat greens. And it goes on and on through all kinds of different animals. And in the end it says, I love greens too. And shows a child enjoying a green smoothie. Now, when children read this book, they want to drink a green smoothie at the end of this book. And all parents know the value of that. Hey, Masia. Are you not getting the attention that you desire? I hope you will explore these books for yourselves and I hope that they enrich your family lives. That is my sincere wish and the reason that my mother and I wrote these two books. So thank you for your attention and we'll see you next time.